I welcome you all in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ on that blessed, glorious, beautiful, awesome, and wonderful time in the presence of our Lord, our Creator, our Maker, our Strength, our Redeemer, and our Light. I pray to God Almighty this hour that may His fullness, His presence, His glory overshadow this platform and every soul present there tonight in the name of Jesus. I want you to lift up your hands and your voice and worship the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the one that has made it possible for you to be alive. You are God from beginning to the end. There's no place for argument. You are God all by yourself. You are God, you are God, from beginning to the end, there's no place for argument, you are God all by yourself, from east to west, there is no other God. From north to south, I say there is no other God. From east to west, there is no other God. From north to south, I say there is no other God. It is only you. Jesus, it is only you, it is only you, it is only you, Jesus, it is only you, there is no like you, there is no like you, Jesus, there is no like, there is no like you, there is no like you. Jesus, there is no like unchangeable, unchangeable God, unchangeable God, unchangeable, unchangeable God, unchangeable God, unchangeable, unchangeable God, unchangeable God, on. Changeable, unchangeable God, reliable God, reliable, reliable God, reliable God, reliable, reliable God, dependable God, dependable, dependable God. Dependable God, dependable, dependable God, dependable God, the Almighty Father, the Prince of Peace, the King of Kings, the one who walks, who is, and wish to come. Father, Lord, we worship you tonight. We bless, we magnify, and we bow down before thy throne, Lord. Take all the glory in the name of Jesus. We are grateful for the gift of life. We are grateful for sound mind, for good health, for happy life. We are grateful, Lord, for your presence over us. We are grateful for the move of your power. We are grateful, Lord, for lifting us up far, far above our enemies. We are grateful for the salvation of our souls. We are grateful for the mercy in the blood of Jesus. We are grateful for purging us from all unrighteousness. We are grateful, O Lord, for creating in us the spirit of sin no more. We are grateful, Daddy Lord, for your hand of power that is always upon us. We are grateful for feeding us day by day with your word. Father, in all situations, oh God, take all the glory in the name of Jesus over our homes, our children, our husbands, our wives, our jobs, our ministries, over our going and our coming. Daddy, we are grateful. Take all the glory in the name of Jesus. Merciful God. We know, O oh Lord, that you have sinned against only you. And we are here tonight, O oh God, to pray for mercy. Lord, have mercy upon us. Wash away all our sins and lay your mighty hand power upon us. Give us victory over besetting sins and give us the grace to live a righteous and a holy life all the days of our lives in the mighty name of Jesus. In Matthew chapter 6, Matthew chapter 6, 
I read quickly verses 14 and 15. The Bible says, For if you forgive men their trespasses, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you do not forgive men their trespasses, neither will your Father forgive your trespasses. I want to beg of you tonight, beloved, have it in your mind to forgive if you want God to forgive you. Have it in your mind to let go if you want to see the face of God. Have it in your mind to forgive if you want to see the glory and the manifestation of God's power. I want you to pray tonight. Say, Lord, give me a forgiving spirit in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord God, my Father, give me, O oh Lord, a forgiving heart and a forgiving spirit. Give us, O oh Lord, forgiving spirit and forgiving heart. In the name of Jesus, give us a forgiving spirit and forgiving heart. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Say, anger and bitterness in my heart. Anger and bitterness in my heart be roasted by fire in the name of Jesus. You, the spirit of anger and bitterness in my life. You, the spirit of anger and bitterness in every life so tonight. Be roasted by fire. 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 Anger, bitterness. Be roasted by fire. Be roasted by fire. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Say, all forgiving spirit. In my heart, release me and die. Every unforgiving spirit in my heart, release me and die. 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 In Jesus' name, we are free. Beloved, unforgiveness will put a life in bondage. Unforgiveness will make cloud of darkness to be over a life. Unforgiveness will sponsor unanswered prayers. Unforgiveness will make a man to be living in bitterness and in anger of the heart. Unforgiveness will make a man to be suspecting everyone. I want you to pray. Say, oh Lord God, my Father, uproot every unforgiving spirit from my life. Oh Lord God, my Father, uproot every unforgiving spirit from our lives. Uproot them all up. Uproot them all up. Uproot unforgiving spirit from my life. Or put unforgiving spirit from my life. Or put unforgiving spirit from everyone's life. Or put unforgiving spirit from my children's life, from my wife's life, from my husband's life. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say, Mighty God, let your agape love reign in my life. Mighty and everlasting God, let your agape love reign in my heart. Reign in my heart. Agape love of God, reign in me. Reign in me. Reign in me. Reign in us. Agape love of God. True love of Christ, reign in us. Reign in us. Reign on this platform. Reign in every life. True love of God. Agape love of the Most High God, reign in us. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Everlasting Father, we thank you. Blessed Savior, we give you praise. We worship your name because you are the living God. Accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Lord, we surrender our lives before thee tonight. Fill every soul here tonight with your presence, with your power, and with your glory. In the name of Jesus, by your name called Jehovah, we come against principalities. We come against powers. We come against rulers of the darkness of this world. We come against spiritual wickedness in high places. We come against the eaters of flesh, the drinkers of blood, the necromancers, the stargazers. We come against the past of the wasters. We come against foundational deities. We come against territorial forces. We come against the Levitian forces. We come against all dark forces and dark powers within and around us. We trample upon them and we bind them with chains and feathers and cast them into the bottomless pit of fire in the name of Jesus. We set their habitation on fire and we destroy all their weapons in the name of Jesus. We declare this program. We declare this platform a no-go area for dark powers in the name of Jesus. We soak this platform in the pool of the blood of Jesus and in the fire of the Holy Ghost. And by the power in the blood of Jesus, we command that everything that we are going to be doing here tonight shall receive God's backings in the name of Jesus. The Lord will back us up. The Lord will back every life up tonight. The Lord will back up our prayers. The Lord will back up everything we'll be doing on this platform tonight in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Blessed Father. Lord, my life, I surrender before thee. Whatever is in me that will make me, Lord, to speak heresy, oh, Lord, forgive, have mercy, break me now, remove me, and make me, Lord, a new vessel in Christ Jesus. Fill me afresh, oh, Lord, with Holy Ghost. 
power and fire and use me as your oracle, as your vessel, and as your mouthpiece to propagate your gospel all the days of my life. Father Lord, fill me, Lord, with uncommon wisdom of the Most High God that will make the delivery of your message to be so winning. In the name of Jesus, to you be the glory, to you be the honor, to you be the adoration. Let this gospel tonight, oh Lord, let it win souls for your kingdom and also depopulate the kingdom of darkness. In Jesus' name, it is settled. We cover this platform with the blood of Jesus and with the fire of the Holy Ghost. Holy Spirit of God, take total preeminence. Fill every soul here and open our inner ears to hear. Open our eyes to see and open our spiritual lives to receive from God in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. I welcome you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ on another beautiful, blessed and glorious time in his presence. My prayers to God Almighty is for God to keep doing great and wonderful things for us in the name of Jesus. To the glory of God, we shall be looking at what the Lord God has given us the grace to look into tonight, which is the continuation of our teaching on learning to pray with Psalms. Beloved, it is good to learn how to pray. Prayer is the key. Prayer is the master key. Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, he started the ministry with prayer and he ended the ministry with prayer. Prayer will pull down strongholds. Prayers will open doors. Prayers will subdue mountains. Prayers will make a life to be closer to God. Prayers will make the enemies to bow. Prayers can heal. Prayers can save. Prayers can open the eyes of the blind. Prayers will raise the dead. By the power in the name of Jesus, we receive the authority to pray and for signs and wonders to manifest in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray, beloved. So many people are praying and they are yet to receive the, they are here to encounter the manifestation of the power of God. Say, my father, my father, my father, tonight I want to encounter the manifestation of your power. Manifest in my life. Oh Lord, my father, I want to encounter the manifestation of your power. Manifest, oh Lord, in my life, in my marriage, in my home. Concerning this platform, oh Lord, manifest your power, manifest your power. Let every soul say tonight, let us encounter the fullness and the demonstration of your power in the name of Jesus. Let us encounter the full demonstration of your power in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen, amen, amen in Jesus' name. And to the glory of God, the Lord is taking us straight to Psalm 128, which is the reward for fearing the Lord. Psalm 128, and it's titled, Reward for Fearing the Lord. Beloved, to fear the Lord is to obey God. To fear the Lord is to walk in obedience. To fear the Lord is to love God. To fear the Lord is to flee from God's enemies. To fear the Lord is to be submissive to the will of God. To fear the Lord is to remain under the canopy of the Most High God. I pray thee in the name of Jesus. May the fear of the Lord be upon us. May the fear of the Lord be upon us. May the fear of the Lord be upon us. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Reward for fearing the Lord. Reward for obedience. Reward for saying, yes, Lord. Reward for following Christ. Reward for submitting to the will and the wish of God. Reward for saying, yes, Lord, here I am, send me. I pray that the fear of the Lord will come upon each and every one of us in the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord. When you fear the Lord, you conquer the fear of men. When you fear the Lord, will you conquer Satan. When you fear the Lord, you conquer demons. You conquer principalities. You conquer all forms of problems. I pray, may you and I receive the fear of the Lord. In Jesus' name, it is done. Psalm 128 from verse 1. Blessed is everyone who fears the Lord. Who walks in his ways? Hear what the first verse of Psalm 128 says. Blessed is everyone who fears the Lord. That means if you if you and I, if we fear the Lord, we are blessed. Blessed is everyone, not few, everyone who fears the Lord, who walks in his ways. When you eat the labor of your hands, you shall be happy and it shall be well with you. Can you see the promise? Can you see the reward? When you fear the Lord and when you eat the labor of your hands, you shall be happy and it shall be well with you. I pray 
that the fear of the Lord will come upon you and I. And when we eat the labor of our hands, we shall be happy. It is only in the fear of the law that you will have happiness in the labor of your hands. It is only in the fear of the law that you will have satisfaction in everything you are doing. It is only in the fear of the law that you will be happy and things shall be well with you. I pray in the name of Jesus. May you and I fear the Lord. May we fear the Lord. May we fear the Lord in the name of Jesus. In verse 3, your wife shall be like a fruitful vine. In the very heart of your house, your children like olive plants all around your table so shall it be in the name of jesus when you fear the law your children your wife your husband all shall be blessed all shall increase all shall flourish i pray thee in the name of jesus may you and i fear the lord may the fear of the law be upon you and i and our entire household in the name of jesus verse 4 behold thus shall the man be blessed who fears the lord the Lord bless you out of Zion. And may you see the good of Jerusalem. Can you see the promises of God for those who fear it in? And may you see the good of Jerusalem all the days of your life. May you and I, may we see the good of Jerusalem. May we see the blessings. May we see the joy. May we see testimonies all the days of our lives because we fear the Lord. Yes. May you see your children's children. Peace be upon Israel. So shall it be in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will preserve you from all evil. The Lord will write your name in the book of life. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will show you secrets. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will rise for you and fight for you. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will go before thee and make all the crooked places straight. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will set a table before you in the presence of your enemies. When you fear the Lord, the Lord God Almighty will give you the sword of victory and the sword of power. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will open great and mighty doors for you. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will show you great and mighty things without rest not. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will give you the land of the living and he will give you the best. When you fear the Lord, not only will you be blessed, your children, your also will be blessed. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will open for the windows of heaven to pour out blessings upon you. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will be the the Lord will fight for you, and the Lord God Almighty will attack all those that are planning attack against you. When you fear the Lord, the Lord will give you sound mind. He will give you healing. He will restore you back. He will bless you. He will establish you. He will expand your cause. When you fear the Lord, it will change your story. When you fear the Lord, it will change your name. When you fear the Lord, it will crown you with the crown of glory. When you fear the Lord, it will make kings to be your foster fathers and queen to be your foster mothers. When you fear the Lord, the Lord God Almighty will clothe you with his Shekinah glory. I pray thee in the name of Jesus that the grace to fear the law, the anointing to fear the law shall come upon us in the name of Jesus. The grace, the anointing to fear the law shall come upon us in the name of Jesus. I want you to lift up your voice and appreciate God. Say, Lord, I thank you for this, your wonderful teaching, so God. Thank you, Lord, for depositing your word in my life. Thank you, Lord, for teaching me yourself, oh Lord. Glory be to your name. Glory be open your mouth and appreciate God for what he has done tonight, for the release of his word upon your soul for the release of his power upon you and your household bless his holy name bless his holy name to fear the lord is to study the scripture to fear the lord is to obey what the word of god is saying to fear the lord is to be or is to submit to god's authority say oh lord god my father give me the grace to fear you give me the grace to fear you give me and my also the grace to fear you give me and my also the grace to fear you in jesus name we have prayed say my father my father my father remove pride from my life oh lord god my father remove pride from my life remove pride from my life from my marriage from my home oh lord remove pride 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 remove pride from our lives remove pride from every life on this platform remove pride in jesus name we have prayed in jesus name we are praying say whatever is in me that is not of god be uprooted and be cast into fire 
be cast into fire. Whatever is in me, whatever is in my home, whatever is in my children's life that are not of the law, be cast out into fire. Be cast out into everlasting fire. Be cast out. Be cast out. Whatever is in your life, whatever is in your home, whatever is within and around you, whatever is buried in your foundation that are not of the law, be cast out into everlasting fire. 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 Fire. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Because I am in God's presence, may the Lord bless me. Say, because I am in God's presence, may the Lord bless me and my home. May the Lord bless me and my home. May the Lord bless me and my home. Because I'm in God's presence, may the Lord bless me and my home. May the Lord bless me and my home. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say, because I'm in God's presence, may God arise and my enemies scatter. May God arise and scatter my enemies. Because we are in God's presence, may God arise and scatter our enemies. Because we are in God's presence, may God arise and scatter our enemies. May God arise and scatter our enemies. May God arise and scatter our enemies. Because we are in God's presence, may God arise and scatter our enemies. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Say, because I'm in God's presence, declaration and pronouncement of the devil shall not stand against me. Because I'm in God's presence, open your mouth and pray. Say, because I'm in God's presence, declarations and demonic pronouncement shall not stand against me, shall not prosper against me and my home, shall not prosper against us on this platform. Shall not stand against us. Shall not prosper. Shall not stand and prosper against us. Shall not stand against us. It shall not prosper against us. Declarations and demonic pronouncement shall not prosper against us. In Jesus' name, we are praising enemies. Waking up day and night to mock my prayers. Enemies waking up day and night to mock my prayers. Oh God, arise, answer them by fire. Answer them, O Lord. Enemies waking up day and night to mock my prayers. Oh God, arise, answer them, O Lord. 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 Enemies waking up in the middle of the night to afflict my life, to afflict my home. Enemies waking up in the middle of the night to feed on my flesh and eat my and drink my blood oh god answer them oh god answer them answer them oh lord and destroy 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 them in jesus name we have prayed everlasting father we thank you blessed savior we give you praise we thank you lord because you are the rewarder of those that diligently seek you but lord tonight with your children we have gathered all lord to seek your face i pray the lord May you have mercy upon every soul here tonight in the name of Jesus. And may you reward us back. May you reward us, O Lord, with blessings, with salvation, with joy, with victory, with sound mind, with good health, and all the blessings that you have apportioned for us. May you release them to us because we are here tonight in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, Mighty Savior. In Jesus' most excellent and beautiful name, we are prayed. Amen. Amen. Amen in Jesus' name. If the message is a blessing to you, share the goodness, tell the world that God is still in the business of rewarding those that fear it. As you share this goodness, may God Almighty use you to save souls in your generation. Remember, beloved, we meet every day, 5 p.m. Irish time to last five on Facebook and YouTube. Tomorrow is Wednesday. We'll be meeting from 11.45 p.m. to 12.15 a.m. Let's come together to seek the faith of God and to pray. And may God Almighty bless you, increase you, establish you, and make you great in the name of Jesus. Let's share the grace in fellowship. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the presence of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Say, hallelujah, let's go. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. God bless you all and keep shining the Lord. Bye.